Somebody come and look at this. Look at this. breakfast for this morning I'm hoping it will keep me going for about 30 miles because that's when I plan to do my first stop I'm hoping to not needing to stop before then gonna pick up some bananas on the way to the meeting point yeah see you on the road Top of the morning to another, look at that, I'm sweating buckets already. And I've only done what, two miles. I was rushing, I was running late to um, meet some of the TWR gang to head to the meeting point. Good morning, good morning. Top of the morning to honor. Good morning. Tell the people Leon what's going on. I've got a tack of the Harveys. <laughs> <laughs> the Harveys. <laughs> <coughs> We're just on our way to the meeting point. <coughs> And the man himself has a puncture. Like the man I'm, himself I'm has a puncture. Better now than later. <coughs> but that's all I'm gonna I say. Just, I just can't believe that, man. Oh yes, our, our lovely tool. Long time gonna see it. You know what? Just, 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 Professional tire changer, true changer. Watch. <laughs> Like and I had a pump, you know, I packed a pump, an actual normal pump. Have you got your canister? I've got canisters. Yeah, I was going to check say, that tire. Check. check inside, make sure that nothing in. Why is me? Huh? Oh. Well, as they say, it's the first time for everything. And I'm going to be using my, um, those two Benito tires for the first time. By this stage, the first TPU inner tube I'd taken out of the bag and tried to install on the tyre was already busted at the seal, but I didn't realise until after I'd wasted a canister trying to pump it up. Fortunately, the second one um, was working fine, so we were able to uh, install it and go on our way. I was like... Yeah, it's got at least all in your leg and stuff. But I don't think it's coming out of the... Um... You see, I just had a trip down here. Oh, no, 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 something again. Where's the coming from, though? That's a, that's a lot of drip, man. Oh, I'll tell you what. Cannot make this shit up, man. Cannot make this shit up. You sure? Yeah, because I was looking at thinking... So, wait. So, we're riding along. Thought we'd like my mechanical. And we're like looking at Carla, she's got all this white stuff on her face and on her legs. Thinking, oh, hold on, Carla, you've got a, looks like you've got a puncture. And because she's tubeless on her brand new Hunt tubeless wheels. First time using them. First time using them. So it looks like the sealant done its thing as she was riding. <laughs> we, haven't even, we haven't even got to the um, start point. Oh, look, what, three, four miles in to the, to the get to the start point and we've got this drama already. Don't worry, man. Oh, sweet memories. Sweet yeah, memories. Ride London 2024. Yeah, we have no idea where we're going. We're just following the crowd. We're just looking out for the other riders that I've got on the um, pink numbers, ride numbers. We're just following them. Right, we're 75 meters away from the start, but I need to find a trap pump. Put a bit more air in my tire. 
Carl, are you ready? <laughs> Off you go. The start of an amazing journey for you. You finished? Oh, don't know what's happened here. We have to um, get off and, uh, and walk. Hope it's not an accident. I don't, know, I don't know what that was about. I think it was a, must have been a bottleneck. And another one coming up. Oh, look. Yeah, another bottleneck ahead. Oh, can't catch a break, man. <laughs> 10 miles down, 90 more to go. Boom, let's do this. Slow in. This section of the route is always the surreal section for me because I'm used to being in the car along these types of roads and um, I keep wanting to look behind me to make sure there's no cars coming. <laughs> Strange, I know. They must be the leaders because I'm not seeing anyone else. Hey! Somebody come and look at this. Look at this. Wow, the sun is out. Time to take off my arm warmers. Right, we're rolling. Let's go, rolling. Ciao.
just past the 20 mile mark another 80 to go we decided we're not going to stop at the 25 mile pit stop we're gonna keep going to the 32 mile pit stop About 27 miles in, feeling all right, feeling all right. So we had planned to stop at the 32 mile check mark in Chipinonga. We've done about 33, 34 miles. Don't know where it is. So we're having to continue riding to the next one, which is I think 46 miles. You finished? It's an unofficial pit stop because we got robbed of the 32 mile um, pit stop which disappeared, wasn't there. So we're now going to keep riding until 53 miles which is the next official pit stop. Raining. It was good while it lasted. It's just a passing sour. Everyone's laid up. Nah, I look at it, I was like. Carla's Slow putting on a, a, a sauna sweat sweat coat. Actually, it's absolutely pissing down now. Yep. <laughs> Oh Lord, and we have gone beyond the point of no return for the 60 mile We're loop. We're done. We've got no choice but to continue on with 100. And interestingly, do you know what they said in the, in the app? They said don't stand under the trees when it's raining. <laughs> oh, okay. Right, at the 53 mile mark, at the welfare stop. Ah, feeling good. It's a bit wet. So glad that deluge is over. The sun is back out again. Time to warm up. Yeah, I did. Pause what? I did. Pause your warm 
No, I'll just let it run because. Why? I forget to restart it. Well, well, we remind each other, but it can slow your speed down. You know, business, you know what I'm finding? I'm finding nowadays you that. Don't care. I don't care now about my average speed and that stuff. I'm more focused on um, enjoying the ride. No, I'm, I'm, I'm into my Yeah, speed. I know. Well, well. <laughs> I'm new, me. Yeah, well, look. <laughs> Especially when you've got with your new wheels, yeah. And it's new. Hundreds of people here. Oh, I could spot some of our crew. Hey! Yes, man, them. Hey, mama. All right, man. I'm feeling all right. Cringe. How you doing, mama? Well, go on. Well, go on, country. Run like Weezy. You good? How are you feeling? Yes. Good? Yes, Oh, there you are. Absolute mud bath. Man, like, e, we got to start meeting like this, brother. I'm not marking hard. <laughs> you got to bathroom, innit? Yeah. <laughs> right. I was going to say, Harriet's it's, it's looking dirty, like a dirty little slapper, but I can't say that my taxi's looking <laughs> like a tart. Look at, look at her. Pablo. Pablo. Right, back in Got a, got a couple of pin, Pinarello pervs over here. <laughs> right, and we're off. We gotta get the, to the 65 mile mark by three o'clock. You reckon we can do it, Fitz? Yeah, no what? It's by three o'clock. Yeah. Yeah, no what? It's last two hours, man. Okay. Yeah. So we we've done 53. Yeah. So that's another what? 12. 12 that's just tough. Oh, that's easy. Yeah, yeah we can do that. Yeah. yeah. Light work. <laughs> Three miles in the bag. Mm -hmm. What's that in? What's that? Thirty-seven to go then, really? Is that thirty-seven? Yeah, my mass was never that good. Unofficial pit stop. Uh, petrol station. When I grow up, I want to be like him. He just doesn't give a shot. Look at him. <laughs> 68 miles in. And um, we've had this horrible headwind for the last 10, 12 miles. Up, oh. Oh. It's now become a psychological ride now. You just got this constant um, gradient, just feeding it in the legs.
37 miles to go. Well, I did. Right, chipping on our welfare stuff. So. Um, we just stopped to, not as a pit stop, but we stopped to question our lives and our sanity. <sighs> Look, hailstones. Oh, gosh. Say hello to Nevin and Mona. Kelly, she runs um, a triathlon club. Mona, ciao. <laughs> See you. Andy. Say goodbye to YouTube. Bye. <laughs> ten more miles to go. Almost there. Ten. We've got ten left. Yeah. <laughs> You can't take Nevin anywhere. Yes, 10 more miles to go. Been riding in terrible headwind for the last several miles. I just feel like I'm just going nowhere, getting nowhere very fast. I must have to cycle backwards. This is bollocks, man. Oh, almost there. Got uh, just under seven miles to go. Hey. It's 
still on the A12. Or is it the A11? I don't know. At this point, I don't really care. I'm just so tired. Watching that back was tiring. If you've got this far in the video, thanks. Really appreciate your, your support. I um, hope you enjoyed the video. And I just wanted to give a bit of context on why I called the video Goodbye Ride London. Although I um, enjoyed elements of the ride, you know, riding with friends and meeting loads of friends along the route, um, more than I had actually captured in the video. I just thought that, that the experience in terms of what the ride did to my body, I don't want to go through that again that part wasn't enjoyable. So my intention is to not do the ride 100. I'm still going to conquer long distance ride, but not for Ride London again. The last 10 miles reminded me of um, the Dunwich Dynamo ride, where it was just rolling hills after rolling hills. The headwinds were just horrific. It was really, really horrible. And you would see towards the end of the video, um, it wasn't just me, lots of other riders were, you know, were struggling as well. But Overall, I'm thankful and I'm really happy that I was able to complete the ride and get a proper medal this time, not a wooden tea, tea coaster, whatever you call it. Um, it's got a bit of weight to it. So yeah, it's, it's a decent medal. Again, thank you for your support. I'm really appreciative of your comments and your feedback um, about the videos that I've been putting out. So I'm not going to drag it anymore, but see you all in the next video. Peace.